Why are bubbles round? Author, Sukyana Sinha. Illustrator, Swapnil Kapoor. Twins Manu and Maya were on their way home from school. At the traffic signal, they saw a man selling bubble making kits. He dipped a plastic wand into a bottle, took it out, and blew into it. A stream of bubbles floated into the air. Some reflected rainbow colors. Ten rupees, he cried out. The light turned green and the bus drove off. Ma, can we buy a bubble kit? Said Manu as they had dinner that evening. Ma said, you can make one at home. Why don't you try it tomorrow? That night, Manu and Maya dreamt about bubbles. Next morning, Maya mixed shampoo with water in a small red bucket. She carried it to the garden. Manu found some pieces of wire in Baba's toolbox. He twisted the end of one piece so there was a small circle at one end. He dipped the wand into the soap water and blew into the circle. He blew hard. No bubbles came out. Blow like this, said Maya, and she blew gently. No bubbles came out. Manu tried again. Oh, they shouted as a stream of round bubbles floated into the air. Kulfi chased them and barked. I am going to make a different bubble blower, said Maya. She twisted the end of her piece of wire into a square. I bet my bubbles will look like little boxes, she said. Let's make other shapes too, Manu said. Manu made star-shaped and triangle-shaped wands. He was eager to see bubbles of different shapes too. The twins watched Kofi chasing the bubbles. All of them were round. How strange. Ma, we tried to make bubbles of different shapes, but they are all round, complained Maya. Round is a special shape, says Sekunda Auntie, their neighbor, who was chatting with their mother. She worked at the Science Museum in the city. When we make bubbles, we blow air into bubble skin. The bubble skin stretches least when it is round. If it is any other shape, the skin will have to stretch more to hold that much air. Bubbles do not like that, added Sekunda Auntie. Bubbles are lazy. They don't like stretching, Manu shouted, and he ran off to blow more bubbles with Maya. Classroom activities. How do you make soap bubbles? Squeeze some liquid soap or shampoo into a cup. Add some water to make a soapy solution. To make sure it does not become too watery, add the water in small quantities. Get pieces of wire, twist them into different shapes. Dip the frame into the soap solution, then hold it up. Observe how the soap film clings to the frame forming a square, circle, or triangle according to the frame. Blow gently on the soap film to make bubbles. When the bubbles leave the frame, what do you see? They may start as different shapes, but they always form round, spherical bubbles. Take a dab of paint from your paint box. Mix it with the bubble solution. Now, blow bubbles. What color are they? If you are on Earth, the chances are that your bubbles will not come out in a different color. As the paint is heavier, it is pulled down by gravity and collects in a little blob at the bottom of the bubble. Do you think adding natural colors like beetroot juice to the soap solution will make your bubbles pink? Try it out. The seven-year-old daughter of a Japanese astronaut asked her mother to find out whether she could make colored bubbles in space. The mother mixed some red fruit juice with the bubble solution and guess what? She got red bubbles. Why? Because there is no gravity in space. The color pigment did not collect at the bottom of the bubble. Why do bubbles burst? A bubble is a bit of air wrapped in a very thin skin. This skin is made up of three layers, soap on the outside, water in the middle, and soap again on the inside. As the water evaporates, the bubble bursts. Thanks for joining us, guys. And remember that AM and PM story time is for any time of the day, whether you're just waking up, noontime snacking, or bedtime is happening. Stop by and enjoy a book with us.